Carolyn, and I'm going to show you the house that I built in Minecraft. I had a lot of fun doing this. Okay, these are the steps. We go up the steps like this, and into the doorway. Oops. Ah! Ah! Ugh. I like to turn around. Even though I'm the only person in Minecraft, I like to close the door. Then, I go, this is my cellar. See? Whee! I like closing the door too. And there, this. We go down some creepy steps. Nothing to worry about. Yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. And I don't have much interesting here. Just a couple boxes and stuff. And then we go over here. And all I have over here boxes too. Nothing much. Oops. And a torch. Pretty boring in my cellar, but I wanted to make it. Because either you have a cellar or you have a basement in your house, right? Right. Ah! Ugh. I hate getting stuck on torches. There. Now this part's the tricky part. All right. We have to go up the steps like this. Oops. And this is my bedroom. Wee! See, this is my bed. My friend taught me how to make the bed with a nice window. That is the big green thing. I made it so that in case I'm flying over Minecraft world and I get lost, that's how I'll know that's my house. That's the big green thing. This. And so I go up here like this. And this is the TV room. Wee TV. I sit on the chair like this and I watch TV. Worse words. Wee. And then I go up these steps. I'm not really sure what this room is for. But I've got some torches in here. I guess that's it. And we go up the stairs, the ladder like this. And into my library! Whee! This is my library. See, I've got a whole bunch of books. Don't you think... Don't you think it's dangerous to have a whole bunch of torches in your library? Not in this game. You can't die in this game. Except if you're in zombie mode. And I've got a whole bunch of windows in here. Because before I put in the windows and the torches, this room was pretty dark. That's a comfy chair. It's rainbow chair. Well, not really rainbow. And then, this is my roof. Wee for roofs. And then, this is the diving board. Ready? Oops. There. Wee. Boom! And you don't break your bones. And look how many stories my house is. Let's get a close up of the big green thing. Whee! Whoops. Whee, wow. That is the big green thing closer up. Whee! Like this. Okay, can you tell me about Minecraft? What do you like about Minecraft? I like about Minecraft because you get to build basically whatever you want and you're the only one in the world and you don't really have to worry about anything else, like no one breaking into your house or stuff like that. And you can basically do whatever you want. And this is my swimming pool. Wee! I like to go swimming in here. And this is the deep end. Wee! So, Carolyn, how do you and your friends play Minecraft? And when you play with your friends, how is it different from when you play by yourself? Well, you just pretty much answered your question. 
when you play with your friends or when you play by yourself. When you play by yourself, then you're the only one in the game. And when you play with your friends, then you and your friends are the only one in the game. And the way you get into their game is click on Wi-Fi games. Okay. But Right, but when you are playing with your friends, what are some things that you do differently from when you're playing by yourself? We build together stuff, like I have a friend, Connor Fitzgerald, and... Um, Tell you what, just say his first name, honey. Start over again. I have a friend named Connor, and um, we build a house together, and then we're going to live. And then my other friend, Anthony, said, you two are living together? Aw, that's so sweet. And we both looked at him like... And then... This is my church. If I could find where it is. I know I had one somewhere. Here it is. Okay, I found it. I think. Yeah, I found it. You go down the steps like this, and then there's a cross on the floor, which I didn't which I didn't mean to do that, it just kinda happened. And then we go in here. This in yeah, what? What did I just do? Whoa. Whoa, what did I just do? Okay, and then you go in like this. And you sit here and sing. This is going to be a picture of God, those red blocks. So try and imagine that. Now I'm going to make a hymnal thingy, the shelf of hymns and stuff like that. There. Now we can sing. That was my church. And I have one more thing that I made for my dad, because we all like, oops, we all like, really special. My entire family likes these. Big green thing. Oops. Lego! Eh. Picking stuck. Ooh. Wee! Lego! I took, it didn't actually take this long to do it. It was kind of fun. Lego! You're probably wondering how I did that, right? Tell me. Well, what I did was I cut the shaped letters in the wall, and then I put the blocks in. And as you can see, the O and the G aren't really on the wall because I ran out of space. That's why the O might look a little weird. Doesn't it all look like it's on the same wall when you do this? Looks fine to me. But, I know one more thing I have to do to make it look perfect. Destroyed my G. There. This. I'm gonna move over here. And then I gotta go work on the O. Oops. <laughs> 